So let us document this, guys. This is our living room, and it has been for a week now, Mike. Has it been for a week? Yeah. Yeah. So as you can see, Halloween is coming, which means it's going to be autumn soon. It's going to be a little bit darker outside. Together with these wooden pieces against the window, you can imagine that it's going to be even darker inside. So, but of course we have our ambient light and we have lights. I mean, that's not the problem, but you do not want to be in light all the time, especially not bright light. So we cannot wait for daylight to reach us again. Yeah. But yeah, there it is. So they brought the double glazing, as you can see here. It's funny. I've never seen it. So it comes as, you know, it comes ready. So this is one window. See, this is one window. And here's one um, a glass plate and the other one is here. So it's it's like, yeah, ready to be put in. Oh yeah, you can see here. You can see here how it comes together. So there is space in between that strip, that almost aluminum strip is the space between the two glass plates, pieces of glass. And what they do is one of these squares they're just gonna put it in and then do the finishing work. But um, yeah, for now, this is what it is and it has been, and it's, it's such a strange feeling, you know, not to be able to look outside and not to be able yeah, to see really daylight. Crazy, yeah, you know, because at first I it really gets well. to you. Yeah, I thought so too. Well, you know, yeah. <laughs> it's no big deal. But yeah, it's, it's, um, yeah. It, it really gets to you. Yeah, yeah. It, it uh, I don't know. It does something to you. So that um, I don't know. It makes you wonder. Those people that had, you know, to hide themselves, and yeah. uh, I found myself thinking about Anne Frank, which actually was hiding um, not too far away from where we live. So I mean, imagine we have the the knowledge that this would be only temporarily, but imagine having to. Um, um, how do you say that? To hide, not knowing for how long, you know, and when and all that. It's just terrible. But... Yeah, and of course, we have daylight at the other end of our apartment. Yeah, true. True. So it's no yeah, comparison. You know, no comparison and... whatsoever. Yeah. Yeah, of course. But um, strange feeling, guys. Strange feeling. Really makes you think and appreciate things that you've never maybe you know appreciated in particular before but uh yeah plus we're blessed with a beautiful view as many of you keep saying and uh yeah so we miss all that but i just looked outside and they're almost done with one half like the half of a complete building from to top to bottom so and they did that in one day. So these guys are really fast. So if they would to start with this, yeah, we thought they were slow, but it turned out, well, it turned out that, um, because there is a note now in the, in the main gate, the main entrance for everyone, the tenants to see, turned out that one of the neighbors, one of these ropes that's inside this, because when you pull this up, there is an, a counter uh, weight that helps you to pull up the window and pull it open. So that rope, uh, one of the neighbors uh, broke. So I think, and I think that's what they were trying to fix because they cannot, they cannot take that away and then just leave her with an open window in the middle of the city. That's just a uh, no go. But yeah, so they did that in one day. So if they would to come back for us, like say tomorrow, uh, last week they worked on Saturday. So if they would to come tomorrow, which is Saturday, I think they, you know, they will free us. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a bit strange. Independence Day. The, the contractor is Dutch, but the workers don't speak a word of Dutch. Not not yeah. word. They're Polish. They don't speak not one word. No. They don't understand. Even when you say good morning or welcome or hi, this, that. Or when uh, I was telling them, do you guys know when you think you will be finished with the building? They don't understand that. So I had to speak in this app that translates. Uh, so yeah, I think they are fresh from Poland, but, um, yeah, that's interesting. Yeah, so communication is a bit, uh, 
No, there is no communication. <laughs> there is no communication, which is very frustrating because you have very basic questions like things you want to know, like what do you guys think you're going to be able to uh, get to us? And, you know, basic questions everyone in our case would want to ask, but you can't do that. So, and they did send us, uh, well, the the Dutch uh, company that works with uh, with us, with this building, contractor. the contractor, he did send us emails and a whole schedule, but that schedule is not what they follow. <laughs> so, which leaves you with, leaves you literally in the dark, not knowing what's next. So like next week, uh, last Saturday, when they came to pull the, to put this up, me and Mike were actually sitting here have, having breakfast and then all of a sudden we saw a head pop up we're like hey, it's saturday but okay yeah sure go ahead so uh but all is fine they're um the best they're doing the best they can and uh yeah so we have now documented fully what happened here at the same time sharing it with you guys because the windows that they do did finish at the neighbors look really really nice so i might do a shot from here the after shot from here but also from the street so that you guys can see plus we have here a building next to us so you can see the um, the difference between the two buildings <laughs>